Today we are in the center of Stockholm. I want to take the time today to show you something special we are building. We are now outside of what is going to be the Ninjas in Pajamas headquarters in the central of Stockholm. We are now by the entrance to our office. This is the first thing you will see when you enter the building. You will get a big glass window which people that are passing will be able to see straight in. I will now take you in and show you the empty shell of what is going to be ready after the summer. And always when I get up here, I got slightly goosebumps on my arm just by walking in. So come on, join me guys. We are now by the entrance area to our office. When you come in, the first thing you will see is a very big glass window. Inside of this glass window, you will have our content creation studio and content room. What we're planning on doing in here is that we're going to have product displays on both walls. We are putting up streaming stations where we can have continuously ready setups for people to come in and create the new content. What we're also doing is that we are implementing our podcast studio as well as a live video studio where we can host uh, events and cast events and different content types. Next to the content room and leaving it, you will have a reception area where we meet and greet guests which wants to visit us as well as fans that we plan on having flowing through our facilities as we take them in use. The first thing that meets you when you get into our new home is a very long hallway. The space is open, so off this hallway there will be two different areas. What we're planning on doing in this space is an office which is creative. It is inspired by uh, Japanese art movements and in particular the super flat movement. If you want to get a little sneak peek on how that looks like and maybe an idea, I suggest going to Google and search up what super flat is. In this section, we are building a very long trophy walk. So essentially the core will be dark. And on each pillar that goes down here, we are placing the trophies that NIP has won through history. At the end, we will always be having the latest arriving trophy, regardless of which team it is. On the right side, we will be building an area where staff, players, and fans can leave their belongings. In this section, obviously cabinets and coat hangers. These are rooms obviously where you take care of your private business and there's not much to see, so we probably not show too much. What we also decided that was a good idea to have for some reason is a shower in case someone bikes to work or comes the dirty route. Leaving the washrooms, the showers and the coat hangers, you will enter to this large space. In this space, we're planning on creating an area where our fans, players and staff can hang out and enjoy games or just socialize together. On this wall behind me, we are placing a large TV, which is going to be approximately the size of the wall. We are creating a lounge area, which can also be converted to a fan viewing area for when we have fans in and watch games from teams participating around the world. The area where we're having the lounge area and the fan activation area will end approximately at the middle of this pillar. Behind me, we are planning on having our staff and employees working with desk spaces and stations going all the way down. At the end of this wall, we are planning on putting in a very large art piece, which is going to again be inspired by our heritage as ninjas from Japan. On this side of the office, we're planning on putting everything that has with competitive performance to do. That is either gaming rooms, kitchen, or we're doing uh, a content studio, which will be at the back. So come on, follow me and I'll show you what we're putting into this part of the office. When you enter this section, this is where we do the most important thing of the day, if you're me, eating. Here we're putting up the kitchen towards this wall. At this section, we're building an open bar, which you can look over to. So if we're having an activation at the office, you can easily access this part from the fan activation area to grab yourself a drink or a snack. In this part of the kitchen, we're building a long table where players and employees and staff can enjoy a nice lunch or a nice after work or a nice dinner 
Leaving the kitchen area at the office, which is placed over here, we now enter the part where we're putting in the competitive section and the gaming rooms. Between each pillar, we're putting in different rooms. This room will be used as a hybrid room when we have three teams preparing for an event or practicing at the same time. This room can be converted from a meeting room to a full-scale gaming room with top-notch setups required by pro players. Continuing down here, this is where we're putting in the two permanent rooms which are branded by and provided and powered by our partners. This will be a long glass wall. We're obviously having closed in sections between the two rooms with a full on wall with proper si sound isolation between the rooms. So players practicing at the same time can't hear, hear each other through the walls. The gaming stations will be placed alongside the walls that are being placed between the pillars. And for this room, we have not yet decided if uh, we are going to have the counter strike room here or there, or the Dota room here and there. We will be putting in a content creation room. Now this content creation room is different than that room. The room we're building by the entrance of the office is more like a studio. What we're doing here is an editing room with stations in the dark for our video content creation team, which is isolated from the rest of the office space that we have. I hope you guys are as excited as we are for our new headquarters. As we continue building this, and in the upcoming months, we will be releasing more content of the progress that we're doing in getting this new operational hub for NIP together. And towards the fall, we will be very happy to welcome all fans, all players and staff to our new home in the middle of center of Stockholm. Thank you guys for watching and we'll keep you posted.